Okay, before this video starts, I just need to set a few things straight. The face you are looking at right now is of a girl who got home five hours before filming this. I was in Fiji for an entire week. Now my body was on a 17 hour different time zone, which explains why I missed my entire first week of senior year. And also why I chose to not sleep at all before my very first day of senior year. Oh, and did I mention that I was also experiencing the worst period of my entire life and my mood swings were insane, as if not sleeping for over 24 hours doesn't already affect that? I'm just warning you, if this is your first video that you've ever seen of me, you are a brave soul. Continue with caution, this is the cheesiest thing I've ever done, but. Oh, and also, if you've been subscribed, there's something at the end that I'm gonna be doing every single week and it might make you feel really special and you might really like it, so just stay tuned, okay, bye. Oh hey, you might be wondering why it is 3 a.m. and I'm in my outfit already. Um. <laughs> Um, so I'm just not gonna go to bed because there's no point. I'm not gonna wake up I'm actually gonna shower and then change back into my first day of school outfit And then I'm gonna get ready and vlog. Oh my gosh. High school's literally starting. Okay. Let's not think about it for two. Okay Update <laughs> That was so gross. As you can hear, there's some ASMR of the Polaroids and my fan just going on, but I decided I can't just stay up all night. That's just bad for me. It's gonna be a big day tomorrow because school has already been in session for a full on week. Well, this is if I get enrolled because what happened was I went to Fiji for dope. So it was like technically like a business trip and I missed the first week of school and I told them that I was gonna be missing, but I'll be back on Monday. And they just said, okay. So I thought I was chill. Like I'm already registered in the school. You know, it's just missing four days it just happens to be the first four days of the school year and then I tried to log into my account and it says I'm no longer a registered student at that school so I don't even know if I'm in high school I'm like I might technically be a high school dropout right now we don't know yet so I'm gonna go to school early tomorrow and try to like get enrolled we'll see we won't talk about other options until that time comes hopefully I get enrolled and it'll all be fine but it is currently 3 38 a.m. I'm gonna wake up at 5 30 a.m. just because I'm filming this video and like I don't really have a thought process for why, but I am. Also, I'm wearing the shirt that I'm wearing to school tomorrow. So, life hack, DIY. Hi, update number two. 4.30 a.m., I'm waking up in an hour, can't sleep apparently, and this time, put my computer up here and it fell all the way down there. It's brand spanking new, baby, and I just dropped it. So, um. <laughs> I'm also like so loopy, like. <laughs> I was traveling for like 24 hours straight and like I'm so disoriented I'm not even enrolled in high school like I don't know what's gonna happen tomorrow I don't know if I have class like what happens if they're just like no like you're not in school anymore and I'm just gonna be like I don't have any other option like please love me like guys what <laughs> maybe I should sleep but it's kind of too late also there's like a lot of saliva in my mouth <laughs> I literally didn't sleep. I'm so loopy. Um, it's 5.30 a.m. <laughs> I'm like, so yay, I got a text. What? <laughs> okay, if you want proof. You can't, my phone's so cracked. 5.39 a.m. Didn't sleep at all. Feeling good about it, you know? Um, I'm gonna start with Starbucks and just gonna get some. I don't know, this angle's really bad. <laughs> uh, every time I sleep, my hair goes and grows up about seven inches on top of my head. Love that for us. Dang it, I just said that. I hate when people say that. I'm gonna start my day off with Starbucks. I haven't even driven in my car for a week because I've been in Fiji. Oh, so annoying. <laughs> I almost forgot my phone. I'm a little all, I don't even have keys. Where am I? Um, okay, yeah, let's go to Starbucks and then I'll start getting ready. I look like a little dingish right now. <laughs> dingus. <laughs> I literally warned you, don't watch this video. It's so freaking weird, but here we are. Just, okay. I'm just gonna pretend like I got in the car. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh. Love my car. Love driving. Let's go to Starbucks. I also haven't had Starbucks in a week. Wow. Yay. It was 5.30 a.m. when I was that excited to go to Starbucks. Also, it's currently 3 a.m. while I'm editing this video. Jet lag is actually killing me. Like, not sleeping isn't my brand. My brand is sleeping, and it's not happening, and I'm turning into a completely different person, and I'm honestly really... I'm concerned. When is this ever going to get fixed? Like, what if I'm just stuck like this for the rest of the year and I can't? Oh my gosh. Oh. 
Okay, <laughs> I think I got a little extra reckless while I was gone because this is a little cray cray. Cray cray. <laughs> Honestly, I'm glad I went to Fiji and screwed up my sleeping schedule because now I am hyper and it's 5.30 a.m. Also, it's probably really dark on my face and I don't care, I'm talking anyway because I'm probably gonna cut this all out, but I'm hyper and I'm leaving it in. What? Please stop tailgating me. I'm going the speed limit. And why are you flashing your lights at me? I'm the one going, stop. Oh, I forgot I had road rage. Hi. Hi, road rage, missed ya. Oh my gosh, I haven't said my intro. Hey, girly pops. No, I'll say it when I have my pink drink. It doesn't feel right right now. I'm gonna shut up. Oh my gosh, so much footage to edit already. <laughs> Bless the woman at Starbucks. She made me the most bestest, beautiful, beautiful, bestest pink drink. <laughs> it's so good. And I got a chocolate croissant. I'm gonna look up what time the sun rises because this lighting is just not giving me beauty guru vibes and that's kind of what I need for this get ready with me. So be right back. Um, so it says the sun doesn't rise until seven and it's currently 6 a.m. Oh my gosh, I'm just watching a spider crawl up my wall. Hey, at least it rhymes, you know. It's now 6.50 a.m. I'm gonna start curling my hair with a straight flat iron, straight iron straightener. And then hopefully by some sort of sunlight, I'll be putting on makeup. I don't even know why I really like waited for the sun to put on my makeup because I'm actually gonna do a completely separate video. <laughs> My channel is just me being like, guys, I don't know what to do with my hair. Like, I don't, I just, um. <laughs> there she is. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> I guess I should do my intro. This video is probably like five minutes long already, but, um. Hey, girly pops. What's up? Oh, I just stuck it in my nose. <laughs> Starting it off quirky. So now I'm going to put on some makeup. I'm just going to put on some quick makeup and I'll do a full makeup, like, not tutorial, but testing it out in a separate video. But let's just, okay, frick, now I'm getting tired. No, my day is just starting. Keep your eyes open, Hickey, you got this. First day of senior year, let's go. Dang it, I'm tired, no I'm not. Okay, now we can start. Um, another life update, I'm like kind of a beauty guru now, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> my tummy hurts, I'm on my period. Ow, oh, my cramps are so bad. <sighs> Jeez, I'm not even trying to be relatable right now. I'm just like actually in pain. Oh my gosh, ow. I'm not usually this bad. I'm a little concerned. Oh my gosh, this under eye bake is like a lot. My tummy hurts. Mood. I was low key a little bit creepy. Sorry about that. You know what? I'll be back when I'm done with the makeup look. So, bye. I'm so weird. I know that. <laughs> coming for you, James Charles. <laughs> okay, wow, that escalated a little quickly. I might be a little bit late, which is bad because I need to like enroll in school or like ask if I'm, like I'm literally gonna go to school, walk in the office and be like, hi, am I enrolled in this school or do I need to like apply again? Or like, am I not a part of this anymore? Am I gonna be a high school dropout? Those are my first words when I walk in. So being late doesn't help that. How did I pull an all nighter and still manage to make myself late? I, oh. I always say I'm responsible and then stuff like this happens and then I kind of question No, I am. I'm like so responsible. Whatever, Haley. I'm so responsible. Hashtag girl boss. But my stomach still hurts really badly and I forgot to put in a tampon. So we'll see how this day goes. Woo! Let's go, baby. <laughs> Girly pop. You guys. Why was that amazing? So good news. I am enrolled in high school. It only took a few minutes of me sitting in the office and they're like, all right, you are officially back in our school. And thank God, because I had such a good day. Like, oh, someone's parking next to me. I don't really want that. Hi, I'm talking to a camera. <gasps> That's where my dry shampoo went. I've been looking for this. What a good day. Number one, I got a coffee because I was falling asleep in all of those classes. Well, not actually, but like, I was so tired that I was dizzy, but I've been dizzy regardless. Oh, heck yeah, boy. I gotta stay up today, okay? That was literally perfect. That was everything I've ever dreamed of. I wanted to still be in school this year, but I didn't want it to take up too much of my time. And what happened today was legitimately perfect. Like, I get out of school so early, and the classes I'm taking are actually good classes. Like, for example, oh my gosh, my voice cracked. For example, in 
in English 4, one of the first assignments was like a college essay. And she was like, oh, like, do you have any that you wrote over the summer? And I was like, no, I'm actually not going to college. And she was super supportive of like what I was doing. And she was like, oh, you know what? You should just write a resume instead. And then I can give you notes on your resume. And I was like, oh my gosh, thank you so much for tailoring this class to something that I'll actually use in the real world. And then I'm also taking interpersonal studies, which like right now we're just taking personality tests, which are cool and awesome. And she was so cool. She was like, I don't believe in weekend homework. This class should just be fun and interesting and helpful to you, not hard. Love that. Amazing. And then I'm taking government my first semester and economics my second semester, which are things that I need to learn like in life in general. And then I'm also taking Spanish online. Overall, like literally my dream, my voice cracks are so beautiful um this is gonna be my dream year honestly it's the perfect balance of still being in a school system without being so stressed out and like tied down by it and like having a, a taste of like also just like working too and then also dance <coughs> i'm just so excited now like I, that that was everything i could have asked for this is probably like the most probably the most positive first day of school vlog you've ever seen because all of these are like so depressing but i'm like so genuinely happy like i walked in i was just so excited and i don't know i'm just really happy oh my gosh i need to go school supply shopping Oh my gosh, let's go school supply shopping, guys. <laughs> okay, let's go. I look like a literal boy in all those clips. Love that for a sister who looks like a brother. Yes, Manly Pops. I'm now at Target to school supply shop. I literally need like... I don't even know, <laughs> honestly. Also, AirPods make shopping alone so much more comfortable for me like it just takes away so much of my social anxiety because i could just like listen to my music and no one would even know so anyways let's go school supply shopping oh my gosh i'm so late to the back to school season but here we go this literally all cost me this cost me a total of $26, which I find comedic because I used to do school supplies hauls that were like $200 worth of stuff because I try to make it so cute. And this year, I'm like, I'm such a senior. <laughs> such a senior, oh my gosh. Like, I don't even care. <laughs> I got these and these and this camo one because camo is ugly and it's kind of funny. <laughs> That's literally it. I'm gonna go to Barnes and Nobles now and do my homework because I already have that. I mean, I did get a week's worth of homework thrown on me and I have a lot of textbook reading to do for government. I can already tell that government is not my strong point. I get a little bit lost when she starts explaining stuff, but I'm sure when it comes to economics and money, I will be thriving. So yeah, yee brother, let's go. Like I'm kind of excited to go study. Let's make us an aesthetic little study vlog, shall we? Okay, jet lag is definitely hitting me. I'm so dizzy and tired and sleepy, very sleepy. I don't know if I should take a nap or if I should just suffer through this. Man, this is like really gonna be a process. It was weird because when I went to Fiji, when I went to Fiji, my schedule was perfect. Like from day one, I naturally got tired at 8 p.m. and just woke up beautifully and naturally at 6 a.m. It was perfect and beautiful and great and I just wish that was, that's how it would be like at home. I can't even speak words anymore, but it's not. I, my schedule is real screwed up as it is and now it's really more screwed up. But yeah, I should probably take a nap. I'm gonna do more homework, edit this video. I was gonna try to go take an Insta picture somewhere and then I need to work out at some point. Get my frick today up. Wow, I'm so tired. <laughs> Man, I'm tired. <laughs> I know what will wake me up. <laughs> it's a little late, but this is my first day of school outfit. Jean jacket from Zawful. A little Minnie Mouse action on the shirt from Urban. My two favorite necklaces are from Forever 21. Jeans are very too tight and skinny, and they are from American Eagle from like two years ago. I should not be wearing them anymore. And these are my docks. They're so hard to break in. Like I get blisters every time still, but I'm trying to make them work because I think they look cool and awesome and sick. Oh yeah, and then I'm wearing two scrunchies. One is from Indiegogo or Indigo clothing.com brand. And then one is from Urban Outfitters. 
I'm back home and now my goal is to clean my room to kind of prepare me for the year. What it's looking like right now. Oh boy. She's a little dirty. A little bit. Haven't unpacked from Fiji. So, oh my gosh. My lens dropped on the floor yesterday and it didn't even crack. Wow. But we're going to see how long I can last today because I'm trying to overcome this whole jet lag thing. Wow. It's only 12.39. I'm exhausted. All right. We got a long day ahead of us, girly pops. Let's, let's do this. Woo! Oh, that hurt. Okay. My day started off great and then I crashed and I can't even like open my eyes to see that I spilled my coffee all over myself. Also, I posted a total of one, two, three items on Depop and I quit. I'm so tired. Hi, baby. <laughs> okay, apparently I'm driving everyone insane. I haven't had REM sleep in well over 24 hours. I was at the airport for at least 24 hours and I didn't, I like slept on the planes, but it wasn't REM sleep. I came home at 10.30 p.m. and I didn't sleep at all. I just went straight to school and now it's 3.44 p.m. and I still haven't slept and I'm going crazy. I'm paranoid. I was walking around my house with a huge knife. Like, don't come for me because I was so ready to use it. I'm also like really hyper. That's why I cancel my workout so I can be with you. Oh, uh, wait, you did? Yes. Because I'm crazy right yes, now? Yes, you're crazy. I have to be with you, baby. Yeah, she wouldn't even let me drive. Mm -mm. Oh, also I had a panic attack. That was really fun. I was bawling my eyes out. And then I was like really happy after, so. Okay, it, it also doesn't help that I'm on my period and it's like the literal worst period I've ever had. Like I've... <laughs> Like literally, I'm not gonna put this in. And I'm like dizzy all the time, emotionally all over the place. Right now I'm really loopy and happy and hungry. We're gonna try to take an Instagram picture, but I don't even like want to look at it with my feed because my feed from Fiji is so beautiful. And then this is like the ugly location challenge, but it's my everyday life, so. You can do it. But I'm going somewhere really exciting this weekend and I'll get some more beach pics, so stay let's, tuned. Let's stay away from the beach, the water. No. Yes. No. <laughs> <laughs> Why was that so cute? We do this again. <laughs> Why are you going over your eyes? It's like all like this. Oh my gosh, I love that. That's so cute. Oh my gosh, I love it. It wouldn't be a Haley back to school vlog if I didn't get chunk fillet. I swear, every time high school starts up again, my eating habits get bad and my sleeping schedule gets whack. <laughs> oh, I was not trying to be relatable, but frick, I just am. Mom, would you say I'm a relatable teen? Relatable teen? Mm hmm What does that mean? Like, you know, the other teens, the youths can relate to me. I don't think so. You're an oddball. <laughs> You're right about that. Also, you're not supposed to go that way, but I'll let you make your own mistakes. <laughs> hey, who's driving? Who's the boss right now? I am. No, it's still me. I'm loopy. I didn't sleep forever. She's an oddball, that girl. Relatable who? Oddball. <laughs> so loopy. I just want to say this one thing. Listen, kiddos, you don't need to get intoxicated or high. Look at me. <laughs> I'm having the time of my life and all I did was just not sleep. Now, am I recommending you don't sleep? No, but I'm like on cloud nine, cloud 11. Yeah, um, I need to sleep. I've seen the stereotypical drunk person and that is how I'm acting right now. And what did I do to get that there? Just didn't sleep at all and kept grinding even though I should have slept. Also, I can't stop blinking like that. It's kind of concerning. Oh my gosh, I got a Snapchat. <laughs> Chick-fil-A mukbang, everyone. One time my dance teacher asked me what I make videos about and I said I did a mukbang last time and explaining what that is to the regular civilian is not good. Anyways, I was going through customs and the guy was really mean and he was like asking me all these questions, interrogating me like I was mean, but I'm not. I was nice. And he was like, how old are you? I said 17 because that's my age, if you didn't know. And then he was like, all right, what's your job? And I was like, social media. And then he, cause I, you know, like people don't know, like most people don't know that it can be your job. So I just said social media. And he was like, okay, yeah, but like, what do you do? Like social media programming, media marketing, what do you do? And I was like, well, I just, <laughs> I just post YouTube videos. 
<laughs> and then he thought I was stupid, so he let me go through. <laughs> I love that story. Mm. Oh my god. I'm sorry. I usually don't use the Lord's name in vain, but I have not had Chick-fil-A in like a month. I literally look like I'm on one in this video. I don't know what one is, but I'm on it and don't know... That's it, just don't know. I should probably go. This probably like looks bad, even though I just like am really sleep deprived, a little stressed out, and a little excited and happy about life, you know, all in one. And my eyes just keep naturally closing. It's a really fun trick that they do. Update, it's only 4.45 p.m. so I still need to stay awake for like more hours. This just turned into a full-on day in my life, but like gone wrong, jet lag, whatever. Subscribe to become part of the family. I almost just fell off my chair. That was not even dramatized. Promise it wasn't clickbait. Okay, bye. I'm kind of concerned about myself. Hi, wow, you made it to the end of this video. I am so proud of you and I'm honestly stunned that anyone is even watching this part. But I've been thinking and I've really wanted to do this thing for a while where each week I do like a girly pop of the week. It's really cheesy, but I just keep meeting you guys or like even just on Instagram, just looking at the pictures that you draw of me or like create of me or just like DMs that you send me, just stuff like that. Like I want to show you that I like recognize you and appreciate you so much because I, I honestly feel like I see all of you guys who are active and everything. So this week's girly pop is actually someone who I met in the airport when I was flying back from Fiji and her name is Alexa. She was so, so, so sweet and she just stood there and like gave me this speech about why she loved me basically and it almost made me cry and she was crying and it was just amazing and it just like made my day so good, you know, because I was just traveling for so long, hadn't slept and she just made my day so much brighter and I just really think that she deserves some recognition and yeah. Um, if you want to be a girly pop of the week or whatever I will be just looking at pictures that I'm tagged in that you guys like draw or create or if I meet you in person I'll get your name one of my friends Leah sent me this like whole video that was super sweet and if you want to send like a video you can just send it on Instagram DM and then make sure it like plays more than once so I can like screen record it or something but yeah I just thought it'd be a fun idea because I want to just like appreciate you guys you're so cute I love you so much I hope you enjoyed this frick show of a video you can subscribe to become part of the family and follow me on Instagram for Fiji pictures. And comment, comment bang bang brother if you watched up until this point because this is what's been getting me through the days. Okay, I love you guys so freaking much. Okay, bye. Watch me fade every day in the morning.